you guys. <laughs> okay, this is the thing. Um, the Holy Spirit, turns out, is um, a very powerful part of the God I believe in. Um, the God is God in Jesus. It's the God of the Bible, but it's there's many other religious texts besides the Bible. Like, Quran is a holy book. Um, the Book of Mormon is another um, holy book. And there's lots of gospels, lots of prophets. Anyway, so all of Jesus, Spirit, God, he keeps making me <laughs> orgasm. Okay, which, that's um, strange. If, if this is something very unexpected. But turns out that he likes it when we bow. He likes it when we bow to God, to Allah, to Jesus. Um, he uses many people and he likes us to worship him okay because he's god he's freaking the holy spirit and um anyway it turns out that he is also in sex he is in um a lot of things he is in everything he's oxygen which when he told me that i thought it was kind of narcissistic of him which is kind of narcissistic of me like i have a lot of a lot of things that i'm pretty i don't know into <laughs> but anyway i have got to zone out and just think about this for a little while okay so i'm going to just pretend that i'm not live and just take a nap or something okay because oh this is what i was gonna say I don't think that the Holy Spirit will do it live streaming, okay? I don't think that the Holy Spirit is going to do that while I'm on the live stream. So I'm going to just leave it on live streaming while I'm taking a nap. And so this is probably going to be boring and there's probably nothing that's going to happen, okay? But I'm going to watch the video later and see if I actually orgasm. Because if I do, then I'm going to be... Um, live streaming at the time. We don't want to hear those orgasms. I don't. I don't. I don't want to tell you. I'm just telling. But hey, if it happens again, okay. I don't make it happen. I'm going to sleep. I hope it doesn't happen. I'm not making it happen. But if it happens again, please. Call in the fire department. It is a medical thing. I am not doing it. Listen, if it happens again, Damon, this is my house. Okay? Look, Becky, don't worry about it. I'll call the fire department. You have your orgasms with them, and I'm going out on the streets. Okay. I'm, I'm, you're good. You're good. It's Damon, okay. don't go out I'm on the streets. Listen, on like no, no. Right. Can I please talk to you for a second? Okay. Sure. I'm sorry that you have friends here. I'm no, sorry. I ain't even that, Becky. I ain't even that. No, I am not in control of this. You. Okay? This is something that I am not in control of at all. Well, okay? If you, you think that you're patient and you deal with people, right? I am not in control of this. I'm not doing it. It is something because I've been possessed by the spirit. So let's say... It's a demon instead of God. Okay, let's just pretend. Anyway, this thing that I'm not in control of, or maybe it's a ghost. I don't know. Whatever, this thing that I'm not in control of possesses my body sometimes. Okay? And so, if it happens again, please call the fire department and tell them that it sounds crazy, but this is the third time it's happened. And she says she's not in control so she needs to take him to a mental institution or something. They know I have a friend. You're helping. Okay? They don't know where the key is. It's outside. I know, Same but where, I mean, they, you they don't know that it's under that table. So I can call 911 and tell them, but they might not believe me. They might think it's a prank call. Mm -hmm. What? Okay. No. Okay. Okay. I don't want you on the streets. Well, David, I seriously don't, okay? I think that this is maybe Satan just doing it. To, I don't know. Maybe it's 
Maybe it's God, maybe it's Satan. I don't know. Something's happening to my body where this is like happening. And I hear these voices in my head that are telling me this stuff. I don't even remember that, okay? I don't remember that at all. I know it happened just a little bit ago and I remember that. But it almost happened again when I when I try to bend over. That's like I don't know if that's when it happens, but there's something medical going on that is making this happen, okay? But I'm not in control, so if it happens again, then please call uh, the fire department or just call someone and yeah, have them take me somewhere. I'm getting tired. I just, sorry, I just rem remembered that I had to tell my roommate that the fire department, if the fire department comes out here, when, if, like, apparently yesterday, right, yesterday, I don't remember this at all. I don't remember it, but yesterday I went out and, or I guess maybe I stayed it. Anyway, the point is, I... Um, um, I have to, uh, uh, if I can, so hard. <laughs> so hard. Oh my God, that's so funny too. <laughs> um, I have to get my phone. Hey, what's up? To the one guy that's watching me. Hey, I know who you are. Or that guy that's across the world somewhere that got me stuff. That um, got me, like, clothes and stuff. Get it. I get it. I know that this God we both believe in. This God who goes by Allah and Jesus. And who loves us both so much. He loves us as much as we love him. Okay, um, even more.
there's nothing but love where he lives. And, um, sorry, I'm trying to reach, trying to reach my phone and trying to bow to all of God. But I have to kind of zone out to um, go to sleep or <laughs> to have an orgasm. <laughs> Which I told my roommate that if it happens, to please call the fire department. Okay. Um, <laughs> because I... But my roommate might actually just go out in the cold because he's actually a homeless friend that I'm letting stay here because he can um, get a place to stay while he also helps me out. So it's mutually beneficial for both of us. Okay, so um, that's the arrangement. He can pick me up and stuff. He's strong enough to. So anyway kind of works out but what am I doing with my phone that's what I don't remember um okay so anyway whatever I was doing not gonna do because I'm gonna go to sleep but I need to take my medicine first so I guess you can kind of watch me do that it's over here on the fridge to call 911 okay because I gotta tell him it's gonna sound like a prank call but I've got to tell him the only thing is if I tell them then one of those shows like like um, 911 call shows, then they will, like, probably use the footage to, for their show, like, maybe, but anyway, they won't, I don't know, I don't know what I'm even thinking about, that's the problem with getting in your head, so it's good to get out of your head and to get into your soul. But it's hard. It's really hard to just get out of your head. But it's important.
Gotta go get some water. back. Got a little mini orange juice. So <laughs> you must not be very busy either because you're on my streams like all the time. Um which is cool with me but it's like must suck for you. Do you get bored a lot of the time? You should tell me in the comments. You should type but then I would stay up all night reading this stuff. Because we might as well get to be friends since we get to kind of know each other. So, hey, what's going on? I got a drink. I'm so thirsty. My mouth is dry. But we're um, almost out of water. I guess I could fill up a new one or an old one. I mean, got my straw.
since I smoke weed all the time, then um, my mouth gets super dry. My roommate thinks I'm going crazy, but I need to move somebody else in anyway. I don't really need to, but I want to. bunch on my laptop. It's good. But anyway, so do you smoke weed? Should tell me. But then I would probably stay up all night. So I can't do that. We'll see if the keyboard will even work later. I don't know if it even will because I spilled orange juice and it's probably into several of the keys that I'm going to need to put. Oh well, we'll see you later. Oh yeah, I can't end the stream. I was going to. I was going to end the stream, but I'm not going to because I have to catch it if I'm having an orgasm while I sleep. Because maybe I will be. I don't know. But, yeah, so this is going to be a super boring video tomorrow. But I'll have to watch it anyway to see if I have an orgasm while I'm asleep. Because, um, apparently, the Holy Spirit gives good orgasms. <laughs> okay. So, we'll just have to wait and see. But I think my roommate's thinks I'm crazy, but maybe I am. Either way, I'm going to need to be moving someone else into the room probably soon anyway, because I'm getting an aid because I need someone to help like with transfers and stuff and also with um, like personal hygiene, like changing my diapers and stuff probably. <laughs> So, um, I'll probably have to get a girl, but who knows? I'll just have to wait till that time and figure it out. Figure it out. But, yeah. That 
is the scary thing. But it's kind of not scary too because it's just going to happen. It's either that or go to a nursing home. So, I don't know why I didn't get a spoon. Got jello, brought jello in here without getting a spoon. So, I'll be back again. But actually, I might have a spoon in the fridge. Check. Because I did have a plastic spoon in here early. Dun, dun, dun. Okay, I think it's in there. But it might be too far for me to reach. Yep, this, but I need a reacher. Oh, the reacher is way too far for me to reach. I need a reacher to get the reacher, and the reacher is gone. <laughs> Which would be a funny song. But I got it, I got close. Haven't got it yet. And it just disappeared. <laughs> yeah. Okay, I know what you want me to do. But I don't want to do it. I want to just slurp it out of the thing. <laughs> he wants me to stick my finger in there. And then lick it off my finger just for you. <laughs> but, <laughs> I don't want to. Maybe. Maybe I do. I don't know. I can't even tell anymore. I don't know if it's me or God. Have the time. Which cracks me up. <laughs> but God's just crazy like that. I'm going to slurp it first. You want me to lick it off my finger. <laughs> lick it up. I don't want. Okay. I have to eat a little bit because it's good, but I'm not going to do all this stuff that all of God wants me to do because he's got a dirty mind. the straw because I can use the straw kind of like a spoon to suck it or I'll use the straw to kind of suck it up first if it'll go the straw has a bend in it so I don't know if it'll work okay you can stick it in there and then suck it out of the straw that's what God wants me to do that's what all of God all that Jesus God wants me to do, okay? It's so all that Jesus and God want me to eat jello out of a straw. And so I'm going to, actually, because all that Jesus God wants me to. And as we both know, all praise, all glory, all honor goes to all that Jesus God. So I'm going to eat jello out of a straw for now because my spoon freaking disappeared out of the fridge while it was in my fingers or right before maybe my fingers were touching it when it disappeared I can slurp it if if I suck really really hard then I can suck it up it's jello but it works but the straw is really um, I don't know if you can tell it where 
Did you see this raw? It's orange. Yeah. Huh? Jesus God, you do what he wants you to do, whether you want to do it or not. But most of the time you'll want to do it because all of Jesus God is cool. Actually, he's cool as shit. I'm going to say it because I can't because all of Jesus God doesn't care. But he doesn't want you to because they don't talk like that in heaven. You get very little jello if you suck it through with the straw from a juice box. Just so you know, if you think this is an efficient way to eat jello, it's really not. Yeah, but it's good. It tastes good. You get like very little jello. Hold on. Might as well get comfortable. I sleep with a light on sometimes, so I'm probably going to tonight. Anyway, I need to get the, the charger for my wheelchair and plug the wheelchair. Actually works though. If you really need to eat jello with the straw, then you can do it. It's definitely a like usable utensil. And my reacher disappeared, which I need my reacher to. The wallet disappeared. I need my wallet. My um. Whatever else, what else? Um, oh, if I can even reach, gotta bend over and then see if I can reach. Where'd the jello go? Oh, I put it on the bed. I gotta reach the charger for my wheelchair. So, gotta make sure I'm down far enough. If 
like a man. It's hard. As you know, it's so hard. <laughs> it's been it's so hard. His foot fell off. Yeah, I need to. I should be recording this too. But I'll get a little bit closer because that thing is a little too far. Let's see if you can see. I can't believe what happened today with when I found out. falling off the freaking chair and then I have to try really hard to pick it up. to get my foot in the little foot booty thing that they give me. But my foot is heavy, so it's hard to pick it up. I have to grab onto my socks and I'm not wearing knee highs this time. These ones go to my calf. And so it's a little bit harder to pick my leg up, but it still kind of works. I just have to bend further. Right now, I 
I got it reached. But the edge of the sock, I got the very top. But this booty thing that they gave me, it's twisted, where it's kind of sideways. And so I've got to kind of pick my leg up and at the same time pull the booty around. You know what you're watching for, right? <laughs> I keep forgetting why I'm making the freaking video. Oh yeah, I'm supposed to have a holy orgasm. Which I don't think is going to happen. I don't think he'll do it on YouTube. But just in case. Just in case. Because when it happens, then I'm not in control, okay? It's the Holy Spirit. He's freaking alien. <laughs> There's a whole lot of things that you don't even know about, okay? You might think you know everything. We're all little mini-gods, okay? We're all mini-gods who think that we own everything, including orgasms, okay? We think that we own orgasms. We don't. The Holy Spirit does. He's the one who can give them. He's the one who can give you mental orgasms, okay? Um, because the Holy Spirit is like the Holy... He is... He is orgasms. He's like the Holy Orgasm. That's the Holy Spirit. That's not the reason why he kind of, even though he loves Christians, he also kind of, um, it's annoyed at him, okay? Because they keep ignoring the all a part of God, okay? Christians, hey, listen up, Christians. Allah is God. God is Allah, okay? They are both also Jesus Christ, okay? And Jesus was kind of like a prophet. He was God's skin on earth. Okay? He was he was God on earth as the prophet Jesus. Okay? God came to earth and lived a life as the prophet Jesus. Okay? But he was Jesus was God on earth. Okay? But God also used Muhammad. God also used Joseph Smith or whoever. God also used um, a lot of different prophets. God uses prophets all the time. That's why, even though Christians are right, so are Muslims. So are everybody else except like, atheists. They're wrong. Sorry, guys. <laughs> I love you. God loves you. I think 
got it. Woohoo! Uh, uh, that feels so good. Uh, that's much better. I got to slurp my jello some more. <laughs> Still jello because it took me, it takes me so long to suck it through with a straw. So I'm going to suck it through with a straw. <laughs> Maybe have a holy oak because with the Holy Ghost, that's what he does. But he does a lot of other stuff too. You can kind of, I don't know, you can't really talk to him, but he talks for you. He tells God stuff for you. Holy Spirit comes and lives in you when you realize that Jesus is God. Actually really good so I wish I could get a lot of this shot but I keep stuff stopping to talk
getting down, but it's still, <laughs> there's still enough jello for a little while. This is a very inefficient way to eat jello. I tried to suck my finger through the, the end of the thing. It's kind of like I'm trying to vacuum with the little wand of a vacuum cleaner.
I want more. Okay, <laughs> there's these Bible verses. <laughs> you should get the Bible app. Well, no, not the Bible app. Um, well, yeah, you should get the Bible app. Okay, if you don't have it, you should get it because it'll tell you all about this God that gives you holy <laughs> orgasms. Okay? Because he can't. He can give you screaming holy orgasms. But you can't. Like, you can't feel it, but um, they're mental. They start out at least as mental. <laughs> I'm going to go to sleep now. Okay, so hopefully I have an orgasm in my sleep. But well, you won't even know because I'll be asleep. <laughs> but maybe it'll happen on camera and then we can record it. Or I can record it if it's on camera. So might as well try it. I guess I could just make a video, but I might as well do it live. So why not? Good night, world. Oh, yeah, I'm better position. Better reposition. hoping that my legs will spasm now because if they spasm then it'll actually feel good oh. Oh, right now oh how are you even gonna know if i have an orgasm it's not like that because you'll hear it i'm screaming if I'm screaming out, I'm having a holy orgasm, then you'll know it. But I'm not at the moment. <laughs> ah. Oh. Hurts, but it kind of feels good because getting off of the pressure, like getting all the pressure off my ass, feels good.
how am I going to know if I'm even having an orgasm while I'm dreaming? That's the question that I'm wondering about. But, I mean, if it's a screaming orgasm and if I say, Holy Spirit, I come, then <laughs> I guess that will...
I'm reverse bowing for a little bit. That's all I got. That's what I do. Sometimes I reverse bow to all I got, which is uh, kind of my way of doing like sit ups. Kind of like actually, it totally would be. If I do it, I should. Yeah, that is totally. Reverse bowing to all of God is like doing sit-ups. If you have a wheelchair, you got to have a power chair like I do. <laughs> then you can reverse bow to all God. If I can sit up, I need to get strong enough where I can sit up and then totally reverse bow to all of God. But it's so much harder than you realize. But I can at least do a hundred of these things. That's like doing a doing hundred the workout thing. I totally should do that. But I don't know if I have enough energy to right now, but I mean, I might as well try since I'm not falling asleep. Yeah, but I haven't really tried to fall asleep. But I should probably try to fall asleep. In the meantime, I'm going to reverse bow for a little bit and crank my hands up. But I can't actually bow right now because my core is not strong enough. But one day I hope to get strong enough to actually... <laughs> Now, I'm going to actually move my chair up a little bit. You know, like, I don't know if it'll make my spasms kick in. If my spasms kick in, then I'm not going to be able to sit up, probably. But maybe, hold on. This totally works because I guess my thighs and my butt is still, it's not totally, the pressure isn't totally off my butt, but it almost is. If I push up, which is probably good workout to actually hold on. Whoops. Okay. Yeah, that's probably a good workout too. Okay, we'll try that sometime. But in the meantime, tonight, I just want to do the bow thing. Yeah, like one day maybe I can actually sit up if I do it enough. But in the meantime, I definitely feel it in my abs. Maybe even my shoulders and my chest a little bit.
planks. Oh, it's it's already falling off. I gotta go back down and get my leg. It's it's kind of like it's it's almost. It might be totally off now, but I don't know. I gotta go all the way down and see. And then move it over a little bit. Being a robo girl is kind of cool. Like, life is good and bad for all of us. I just happened to have a wheelchair, but it's okay. I'm cool with it. I love Allah and God and Jesus and um, you too, of course, and everyone else in the universe because all of God is in me and in you and in everyone else in the universe, which is why I love everyone. We are called to love everyone. And I know that, like, you probably love Allah and Jesus, but do you know that Jesus is Allah's skin? Jesus is the skin of Allah. But he's more than just a prophet because he was Allah here on earth. And you have to know that Jesus is God if you want to stay in heaven, okay? Because if you don't, then you might get destroyed when the world gets destroyed. Or you might be stuck here as a ghost. Or you might go to hell. Satan's going to hell. But you might get stuck here as a ghost. And I don't want that. I want you to be in heaven with everyone else that's in heaven. And with me and with my um, Allah husband. And my earthly, my earthly, my earthly, actually I don't, I have all a husband. I don't even have a husband. Which is really good. I don't want one right now. I just want, uh. relationship with my savior my jesus god is my strength and my love and he can help me get my foot on there because it's so hard I think he likes it. He likes it when it's hard. But it makes you stronger. That's why he likes to make it hard.
believe that the Holy Spirit can give you a holy O. Oh. But he can. And he does. And he does, like, here on earth. I'm sure he can in heaven, too. <laughs> he does it on earth. But it's kind of overrated on earth, actually. Because, you know, you have, like, a body that actually orgasms. But most of the orgasm is in your head, anyway. You know? It's like build up of, of listening to, to Bible verses in your head. <laughs> That's what my freaking orgasms are. <laughs> but I gotta find out the Bible verses because I don't remember what verses they are, but you have to say them in a certain order and it gets confusing because I can't remember stuff. But I have to sleep now.
Yeah, yeah, so I walk through the valley of the shadow of death. I will fear no evil, for thou art with me. Thy rod and thy staff, they comfort me. Thou anointest my head with oil. Thy cup runneth over. Surely goodness and mercy will dwell with me all the days of my life, and I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. And I will feast at the table of spread. No, that's wrong. That's wrong. That's totally wrong because people aren't going to feast in heaven because we don't have bodies in heaven. Okay? That's probably written down. I know that's in a lot of songs. Okay? I know that's in the Bible. No, it's not. I don't know if it's in the Bible or not. Tell me. Look it up. Yeah. Wait, I think it is in the Bible. So if it's in the Bible, then it's. No, no, I don't know. I don't know if we're going to eat in heaven. You go look it up, figure it out, and tell me. Okay, because I don't know what's true or what's not. I don't know a lot of stuff, and I talk too much. Sometimes I can't sleep because I keep talking, and I need to sleep. Hold on. Okay, I'm going to try. I'm trying to shut up, get on my head, and just. Okay, now I'm going to say, surely goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life, and I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever, and I will feast at a table spread for me. Maybe so, that's what I said last time. <laughs> Wait a second. <laughs> that's what I said last time. I keep forgetting. I don't know if that's real or not, okay? So figure it out and tell me. <laughs> Okay, surely goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life. And I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. Surely goodness and mercy follow me all the days. Trust in the Lord with all thine heart and lead not under your own understanding. That's what it means. It means get out of your head and enjoy the moment.
all it is, God. <laughs> that's what that's what I need to like tell the world to tell the world that all is fun. <laughs> like I know you know that, but most people don't. And most people, even Muslims, don't know that Jesus is also God. Okay. All of Jesus it's four it's four thing, okay? I believe in Christianity. Okay, Jesus is real. God is real. Allah is also real. And God. So it's four. It's not a trinity. It's a whatever four is called. That's the whole. I need to tell. I need to tell the world. I need to tell. Christians. I need to tell Muslims. I need to tell. <laughs> I already did. That's what the Holy Spirit keeps telling me. Okay, I gotta leave it alone. I gotta let all of God. Let me rest. Let me rest. All of God. Jesus, all of God. Let me just. Jesus, all of God. Holy Spirit, for you. <laughs> hey, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Forgive me, all of God. <laughs> Forgive me, Jesus, all of God, Holy Spirit. <laughs> I love you guys. You're awesome. Now I'm obviously not going to fall asleep with my hands on my eyes in this position. Okay, I get that. But that doesn't mean I'm not going to try. <laughs> like, wait a second. I don't even know what I'm talking about. That's the thing. God, it's freaking hilarious. Okay, let's just get this out there. God is hilarious. He makes me laugh all the time. And he's just... I can hardly wait. I can hardly wait to get to heaven. But I can wait because this life is amazing. And um, I'm going to enjoy every second of it. I'm going to eat, like, wonderful foods. And I'm going to celebrate life while I'm here to do it. That's why I don't even want to sleep. Like, I don't even want to sleep. This is why. I shouldn't even be here. <laughs> like, I mean, I should. I should be here. I should be here in the universe. I should be here in my wheelchair. I should be in this reality. Okay, I love this reality. I love this world. I love this universe. I want to stay here as long as I can, but I don't know how long that's going to be. Okay, so I want to stay here as long as I'm supposed to stay here. I want God's will. I want all of God, Jesus, and the Holy Spirit to have their way in my life, in my heart, in my mind, for sure, in my body, everywhere.
Okay, I'm gonna stop live streaming. <laughs> Actually, no, I'll keep I'll keep the live stream going. Okay, but you're gonna have to watch me um just get on the computer for a while. So I'm gonna ignore you, even though you watched. I <laughs> get it. <Good> job. <laughs> but I'm going to. You don't have to watch me sleep. It's gonna be super boring. I'm probably not gonna actually orgasm while I sleep, but you never know. So you might get lucky. Ow. <laughs> In the meantime, I'm just going to try to bend. Which is easier said than done when you're frozen. Because my freaking body. <laughs> but I don't care. It's just skin. It's just skin like Jesus was. Like Muhammad was. Like. Hey. Gay people are. And transgender people are. And boys are and girls are and everyone else is fat people are skinny people are if you're ugly if you're <laughs> no matter what you are you're just a skin okay you're just a skin like ian was like god uh, once uh, no god isn't uh, god is all okay all is god so is jesus jesus <laughs> jesus was god's skin okay jesus was God's skin, but he was also God, okay? Because he was God's skin inside, like, well, let's see. No, he was fully God because he was already God before. Yeah, okay, so Mary. Mary was his mother, okay? But his, well, she, like, nursed him, but... He was different from a prophet, okay? Because the little seed that got in Mary's tummy was from the Holy Spirit. So the Holy Spirit, because he can go through anything, okay? He can go through a wall if he wants to. He's kind of like a ghost. All spirits are, okay? When you die, you're going to be a spirit too. I'm going to be a spirit too. And we're both going to be able to go through a wall if we want to. Well, the Holy Spirit was a spirit, so he could just go through a tummy. So he went through Mary's tummy. And um, so when he came out, then he was still God. He was still God, the same God that was in heaven before he came through Mary's tummy and got in her. But he needed to be a human for a while. He needed to have a skin, okay? So he was God because he got stuck in Mary's tummy, the little seed of God, got stuck in Mary's tummy, and then grew into a baby, and the baby was Jesus, Jesus, 
was God's son here on earth because the Holy Spirit just put him in Mary. But yeah, he did have to use her body for a little while. And so, but <laughs> that's because he was a baby, right? Babies need stuff. So they need food, water, like I mean, not water. <laughs> Babies don't drink water. They need milk. Gods don't need anything. Gods just need. But this thing, this thing that was God decided to make a human, which humans need stuff, okay? So Jesus made a freaking human. God made a human. And they put it in Mary's tummy. That's why Jesus is Lord and King, my Savior and Redeemer. He, that's why when, when he was here on earth and we killed him, it's, it sucks so much. Like, why'd we do that? Why did you just kill an alien? Like, no, he wasn't an alien. Okay, like, he kind of is. Okay, he kind of is an alien because he um, is not from this world. That's the definition of alien, right? So, he technically is an alien, but he is... Super, yeah, he technically is an alien. Okay, so we'll call him. No, we won't call him that. Because he doesn't use the term alien. Because he also lives here. So he's kind of like, he's just a Holy Spirit God. All uh, Jesus. That's all it is. It's a holy foursome. <laughs> But what was I doing? What was I doing? Oh man, oh yeah, I know. I think I'm going to go over here. I gotta see if... Oh, if I wrote something down. Okay, hold up. I think I wrote down what I want to tell you. Okay. trying to write a book. Wait a second. Oh yeah. Okay. <laughs> All right. I'm just going to say this. All right. I'm trying to write a book, but the Holy Spirit keeps distracting me by making me come. I'll piss him off by telling you about him. He's one of those persons. He's one of the persons. Persons. Those. Okay. I got to fix this thing before I actually record it again on YouTube. But I'm gonna just fix it in the meantime. Oh yeah, I'm live, uh, anyway. Oh yeah, I don't care if I'm live. I'm just gonna fix this real quick. I'm working on, on a little paragraph for the world okay persons he's one of the persons those Jesus freaks keep talking about he's one of the persons those Jesus freaks Keep. See, there's there's tons of letters 
in here that I didn't actually put it in here. Because the, he's one of the persons that she's afraid to keep talking about. My point is, do me a favor and read the following verses. the following verses from their famous Bibles in we go again. I'm trying to write a book, but the Holy Spirit keeps distracting me by making me come. I'll piss him off by telling you about him. He's one of the persons those Jesus freaks keep talking about. My point is, do me a favor and read the following This is so funny. I'm going to write down the secret for the whole world. I'm going to tell it. I'm going to read it on YouTube. Okay? But I'm going to write it down. And then I'll read it on YouTube for free to the whole world because I don't care. <laughs> I'll trust God because I believe that he exists. So I'm going to trust him to do whatever he's gonna do because i know it's gonna be fun because he's freaking hilarious okay hi
Okay, I'm gonna read this. Okay, but then I'm not gonna. Like, I don't even know what I'm gonna do after that. I have to take it moment by moment. Okay, that's all you have. All you have is this moment. All you have is right now. All I have is this moment to talk to you and to tell you that I'm trying to write a book. But the Holy Spirit keeps distracting me by making me come. I'll piss him off by telling you about him. He's one of those persons that the those Jesus freaks keep talking about. My point is, do me a favor and read the following verses from, from their famous Bibles in the following order and see if it makes you come. He goes by Allah and Jesus and God. He and he is as many prophets. Anyway, he loves you and wants you to scream his name. <gasps> That's gonna be awesome. Okay. That's the book I'm gonna write. Um, but I'll also read it for free <gasps> on YouTube once I write it. But I'm not good at talking. I'm kind of good at writing, I guess, but not really because God using me. God is freaking user. All of God uses people. Okay, sometimes he makes you bow. <laughs> he likes you scream in his name out when you're having sex. He thinks that's awesome when you scream out, Oh, God, yes. <laughs> oh, God, yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> that's what he likes. But anyway, okay, where is this? Um, th there's a whole lot of verses. I've got to, I've got to memorize the whole freaking Bible. I gotta figure this out. I gotta figure out what the verses are. It's it's a lot of the famous verses. It's the verses that like you know and um, a lot of people probably know. I don't know if you know them, but a lot of people that read Bible is probably know them. But I can't remember them. So, anyway, maybe I'm supposed to write a book about it. But I can't write a book if I can't get any sleep. Except maybe I'm not even supposed to sleep. Because sleep is actually overrated. Your body needs to sleep. You don't, probably. I don't know. Maybe you do. I don't know. Gotta wait till heaven and then we'll find out. Heaven is full of all kinds of stuff that we don't have here on earth, okay? We have, what we have on this planet is like beautiful and wonderful and amazing and there's a universe inside, there's a universe outside. Like we are part of the universe. We are like amazing little creatures, okay? But in the grand scheme of things compared to the rest of the world and the fact that we're just one of the many, as evolutionists know, we are just, well, we're not. Evolutionists get some things right, but they get some things wrong, okay? Because they most of them don't believe in God. But God is real, and he wrote a book called the Bible, and that is his word. So most of that is true or Maybe all of it's true. I don't know. I'm just a person. I'm just a human. I'm just a dot. I am actually just a letter in God's book of a world. Okay? He made a book. He wrote a story. He gave us universe. Oh, I can't even get it anyway. I was trying to reach for it. Um, for like a paper, <laughs> no, not a paper, um, a drink. I was going to get another drink because I'm still thirsty. Okay, I'm still thirsty, but I can't reach the drinks. <laughs> so I'm not going to drink anything. <laughs> I could try slurping some more in my jello, but it's all gone. So I don't know, and I want to smoke marijuana, but... I keep thinking that no, I should probably just try to sleep, but I'm not falling asleep, so I don't even know what to do. I'm going to smoke a little bit from this pipe, and then we will see. <laughs> so, join me if you have a weed. <laughs> if you don't, 
And I'm sorry, but you can't join me. <laughs> and kids, don't smoke. Smoking destroys your body. You shouldn't eat edibles. No, you shouldn't eat edibles. <laughs> but if you do, then God's not going to kill you for it. No, it's just a plant. Marijuana is a plant. It helps a lot of things. Anyway, hey, I, when you showed me on that video that, um, you have, like, a bunch of clothes and wonderful stuff, like, I totally appreciate that, I think that's really cool, um, but I can't come there because I don't have a passport, I can't even leave my own country, I have to stay in America. But I would love to go visit you. It would be fun. But I can't. Um, you can come visit me if you want. <laughs> if you want. I'll say hi for sure. We can hug for sure. But um, I'll tell you all about Jesus because I'm a Jesus freak. Now, I wasn't always. I used to just be a normal person. No, I was never really a normal person. That's a stretch. <laughs> but I used to not be so obsessed with Jesus. Like, I was, I still thought he was real, but I thought everything was real. But everything's not real. But all that is true, and Jesus is true, and God is true. And Mother Nature is true. I don't want to forget her. She's awesome. Mother Nature is actually a spirit. It's actually the spirit that is Jesus, all of God, and Mother Nature. It's all wrapped up in pretty little package. Well, I don't know if it's pretty or handsome or just wonderful. It's just Jesus. <laughs> When we get to heaven, then we get to meet him. We get to see him up close and personal. He is the light of the world. Now, see if I have. Any marijuana left in this bite or the other one? Now there's still a little bit. On the outside of the little, hold on, I gotta, my fingers don't work very good, and so I drop a lot of stuff. I just drop the little lid for, for the thing.
think Allah, okay, the Allah part of God, okay, this, yeah, that makes sense, that makes sense, it's, it's not Allah, well, yeah, it is, but it's also, ah, uh, ah, uh, uh. Oh my god. That's that's the thing. So all of, it's all I got. That that is <laughs> so freaking funny. I need to write about. I need to write in my book. <laughs> that all of God likes it when you scream out his name. When you scream all of God. Oh, all of God. Oh, yeah. God likes that. screen fell out. So I'm kidding. It all was fixed up. But this is a problem. It's gotten holes all over it anyway. But I got some other screens because my friend gave me some. But I can keep that in there for now. I don't want to suck it down my throat. <laughs> Where'd the lid go? Oh, there it is. It's underneath my lighter. I think I'm supposed to tell you something else, okay? Like, well, no, maybe not. I don't know. How, why would I not? Yeah, yeah, definitely. I'm supposed to tell. Okay. Um. Oh, yeah, I already did. <laughs> I already did. I already told the world. Okay, but I need to have like a experience with all of God on YouTube live streaming. Oh yeah. <laughs> really? Okay, I'm supposed to I'm supposed to have spiritual orgasm, okay? I'm supposed to have um one live streaming on YouTube. 
So I'm just going to have to live stream stuff for a while until I hear that still small voice. Okay. Do you like listening to silence? A lot of Muslim people, I think, like listening to silence. And so do I. Okay. I'm half Muslim. Okay. I'm half Muslim. I am. I believe in all of God, but I also believe in Jesus. I believe in Jesus, God. Um, Jesus, Jesus, Mother Nature, all of God. I believe they're all one. They're all the same. Like those, they're they're like a fives. No, they're they're a threesome. Okay, they're a holy trinity. Okay, a holy no, a holy quadruple. Quadrupality. Quadrupality. That's the problem with Christianity. Okay, that's the only problem because. We get three out of four, which is really good, okay? Christians are really great, but Muslims are also really great, okay? But the Holy Spirit is both, and in, 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 in both, like we all, Jews, they don't believe in that Jesus was the Messiah, but he actually was. Like Jewish people, they're they're so many people get so many things right and so many things wrong about all of Jesus, God. No, maybe it no, no, it's not Mother Nature. Like maybe it is all of Jesus, Mother Nature, God. Yeah, it totally is. It's all of them. It's a five thing. It's a, there's five persons, okay? Christians get three out of five right. So they're doing good, okay? Muslims get two. Well, you guys love God and Jesus. No, you love Allah too. Yeah, Christians and Muslims both get three out of five. Because it's actually Allah, Jesus, Mother Nature, God. Who's the, who am I leaving out? Allah, Jesus, Mother Nature, God. Oh, Holy Spirit. Holy Spirit. There's the Holy Spirit. Jesus. Allah. Mother Nature. And God. They're all combined in this one person. Okay? When he was on earth, he was called Jesus. Okay? When he's back in heaven, then he's called God. Um, his name is actually God. But he's also called Allah, and he's also Mother Nature because he made everything and everyone, okay? But he's not really either one. He's not really Mother Nature because he's, like, yeah, he kind of is because he's the creator of everything. He's the one who makes it all without him, by him. What is that verse that says, like, everything was made by him without him? Nothing was made. Oh, no. Um. Oh, Jesus. Yeah, I think he is Mother Nature. There she is. Okay. All of Jesus, Mother Nature, God, Holy Spirit. The the those are the 
people that make up the concept, <laughs> uh, which isn't really a concept because he's actually oxygen too. Yeah, I have to write this. Okay, I'm getting off here. I don't want to be on YouTube anymore. I gotta write. I gotta write all this down before I forget it. Because <laughs> I forget everything all the time. That's the problem with having a brain. But I only am going to have it on this planet. Okay? Um, Because when I get to heaven, I'm not going to have a body. And you aren't either. And so... Like, we all get to just hang out with all of God. But if we want to, like, I don't even know how it's going to work. I'm just excited. It's just the next great adventure. You've got to live this life. This is the only chance we got to be here. And you got to enjoy every minute. Enjoy every minute. And, yeah, love life. Love each other. Celebrate. Anyway, I gotta shut this off. Oh, there's... Nope.